Even accidentally killing a mouse can teach martial arts. Upon hearing about the opportunity to learn martial arts, Little Bai decided to learn a move immediately while playing with a girl. Charging fiercely, Little Bai knocked two henchmen behind him flying, gaining experience points. At that moment, the system reminded of memories to be combined. Integrate now? Little Bai calmly watched the flashback summary, realizing his family had been slaughtered. He ended up in the wilderness after being thrown off a cliff. The beauty in his arms was not a stranger but his personal maidservant. Bits and pieces of Lin Yuner's memories surfaced. The system also told Little Bai the main quest was to uncover the truth of his family's annihilation. Just then, Lin shyly looked at Little Bai in his arms and stuttered that she hadn't eaten for two days. Hearing this, Little Bai naturally abandoned the main quest. How could he ever let his woman go hungry? After completing tasks, they enjoyed a hearty meal to level up and fill their stomachs. They arrived at night without delay, Xiao Bai and Lin Yuner. Returning to the city, Xiao Bai was amazed by the bustling market again. Passing by a building, a new odd task came up, requiring Xiao Bai and Lin Yuner to spend the night at Erythro's house with a minimum of three people. No ordinary feat, but Xiao Bai's nonchalant pat of the holy maiden's bottom hinted entering Erythro's house overnight would be easy. Enough said, just give me a moment to handle payment. However bold it may sound, facing ten eager girls in the room, Xiao Bai felt a bit hesitant. He proposed, let's discuss. Hold off on undressing. I'm not here to fool around, I'm here to have a good time. Yet the ten ladies inquired, what's the distinction? Indeed, understanding between people is difficult. Xiao Bai signaled for everyone to raise their hands for a backslap game. Whoever wasn't hit would have to drink. With claps resounding in the room, onlookers couldn't help but exclaim, ah, youth is truly amazing.